Gary, a superb victory at Bromley. You must be very proud of the team. Yeah, I am. Um, obviously going down to 10 men um, to come away with the three points here. A clean sheet is a, a fantastic effort by the players, uh, the backroom staff and obviously our supporters as well. It's uh, a fantastic day for us. Quality, spirit, work rate combined, how, how would you sum it up? I think you've, <laughs> you've hit the nail on the head. It was a combination of all of that. Um, you know, after the sending off, we dug in, we had to, we worked hard. Um, you know, me and James at half time, just leading up to half time, spoke about uh, the change, the tactical change. Uh, James had his say with the players, and obviously, I, I had my say with the players, and the players took on board what uh, both of us said and put it into practice. And um, it was a fantastic, uh, professional second half performance, I felt. But it, it was more than just a backs to the wall display, though. It was, yeah. Um, you know, Matty coming on, uh, closing down in the, in the far corner, and his awareness to find Renz, who then quickly finished, um, showed a bit of quality. and the organisation and the work rate by the players uh, in front of our supporters who I thought were magnificent tonight again um, it was just a, a real good display considering we were down to 10 men that second goal only four substitutes but those two players coming off the bench combined to, to seal victory and it was just the excellent the, the willingness to chase down a lost cause for Matt McClure that created the chance for Scott yeah he's, he's got that in his locker but I, whole, I thought the whole team done that tonight we had to um, you know, we had to change things around. Cody coming on, um, you know, we had to take Rowie off, who was unfortunate, but it was a tactical change. And then we took Fabian off because we wanted Matty with his energy and his legs. So uh, <coughs> the changes worked for us, but um, everyone to a man, uh, the backroom staff, everybody uh, played their part tonight, and uh, it was a very pleasing uh, night for us. That's now three consecutive clean sheets. This evening it was achieved with. Callum Reynolds at left back, Jim Kellerman and Cody Lyons Foster at right back. That's huge credit to to that that unit, but the team in general as well. Yeah, look, the players, you know, they've fitted into uh, positions that they're unfamiliar with, um, and they've gone about their tasks in a in a very professional manner. But not only on uh, that, they they've performed extremely well in their positions as well. And you know, Lewis coming in as well, uh, new to the to the group. Um, again, he's contributed as well. Uh, so, as I said earlier, everyone to a man has played their part tonight and uh, a hard fought one. It was uh, a bit niggly out there at times and uh, we come through that so we showed another side to our game also. In his two clean sheets previously at Hartlepool in against Wrexham, Lewis fortunately didn't really have much to do but he showed a couple of excellent moments this evening. Yeah, had more to do tonight um, and we, he showed us what a good keeper he is and uh, they were, they were going to have moments, of course they were, you know, uh, they outnumbered us but we, we put a formation out there to try and limit them, and I think we did. Um, I know they had a man sent off late on, but we, we had the majority of the game, uh, if you like, down, down to 10. Um, I'm, I'm just delighted with the performance. The first goal, the, the lead came in the first half, another moment of brilliance from Bernard Mensah, but the build-up came a couple of times. Lewis had kicked the ball out to Callum yeah. in the build-up to that goal then the, ball, the play had been spread. That, that's clearly something by design. That's not yeah. just Lewis trying to clear his lines. No, no, his distribution was very, very good uh, you know, for the goal. And uh, when Mentz scored, you know, we congratulated Lewis on his... Because you know, it came from him, basically. It, it built up from him. But we switched to play well. Uh, but let's be honest, Mentz has left Peg. It's a wand. And uh, we see that quite regularly on, you know, on the training ground. And, but to do it in a match situation uh, in a game like this is uh, very pleasing. But it was a great strike. And um, you know, he showed what a quality player he is. Finally, the shots are at the top of the league this evening. I know it's it's only November, so it doesn't <laughs> it doesn't really count. But it, there's an excellent run developing here. Does it? The next game is clearly the most important. But does it feel like tonight was a maybe a significant moment, a, a step taken forward? Yeah, it was a big moment for us because we we picked up three points uh, with ten ten men. Um, if the season stopped tonight, it'd be fine, but it doesn't. There's a long, long way to go. Um, and as you rightly say, um, you know, what is it, back end of November, um, <coughs> if they change the rules and it was our last fixture today, it'd be great. Uh, but, you know, it's three points in the bag. We wanted the three and uh, very pleased with that. Excellent. Thank you, Gary. Congratulations. Thank you.